welcome you to the study of Unit 5. This is the last unit on biblical backgrounds and foundations for missions, and it is part two related to the New Testament. There will be some lectures by Dr. Ken Taylor, and you'll be reading some very exciting chapters in the book. One uh, is called The Heart of the Task by Zane Pratt, and Dr. Pratt is one of the uh, strategists and key leaders of the International Mission Board of the Southern Baptist Convention, so I think you will gain a lot from that chapter. You'll also be reading about the power of the gospel, and an interesting chapter uh, deals with apostles even now. So I really believe that the textbook chapters will greatly benefit you. You'll begin to see some uh, what's called mission sidebars, and one of those that you'll see deals with chronological Bible storing and uh, another deals with how do you research uh, people groups and these can help you in some of your upcoming projects for the class. Now again, you're in different varieties uh, of this class, variations, and you will need to be aware of the uh, weekly assignments that are due uh, based on the way you're taking the class. Let me give a reminder again to those in the mentoring version that you must be meeting weekly with your mentors and those in the pure online or hybrid courses you have other assignments such as the research project on which you'll need to be working so let me stress how important it is whatever version of the class that you're in to keep up with the weekly assignments especially as we're getting to this point in the semester and again for the mentoring section, you need to not only meet with your mentor, but you need to be discussing what you're learning in class as well as the ministry that you're doing in the place you're being mentored. Everyone needs to prepare for the unit quizzes and be working ahead on upcoming assignments. So let me encourage you to stay on task as we're approaching the uh, around the third point of the semester. And I just want to encourage you to keep on keeping on because this is the time that some will begin to grow weary and well-doing and let's let me encourage you to take the words of the apostle Paul to heart where he says to press on and let's keep faithfully carrying out our assignments as a way of giving glory to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I pray you have a good week of study.